The Permian period, a time long before the dinosaurs, saw the rise of remarkable creatures called pelicosaurs. These early reptiles, though not direct ancestors of dinosaurs, were pioneers in their own right. Among them, Dimetrodon stands out, instantly recognizable by the enormous sail on its back. This imposing structure held aloft by bony spines likely played a role in thermoregulation, absorbing sunlight to warm its body. Dimetrodon was a formidable predator, its powerful jaws armed with sharp teeth of varying sizes. This dental arrangement, known as heterodonty, allowed it to tackle prey with greater efficiency. Fossils suggest that Dimetrodon thrived in what is now North America and Europe, stalking the swampy landscapes of the Permian. The discovery of Dimetrodon fossils provided crucial insights into the evolution of early reptiles. Their unique adaptations, particularly the distinctive sail, highlight the diversity and evolutionary experimentation that characterized life during the Permian. These fascinating creatures, though long extinct, offer a glimpse into a time when reptiles were beginning to dominate terrestrial ecosystems. As the Permian period progressed, the Earth witnessed significant changes in its ecosystems and the creatures that inhabited them. Among these changes, a new group of reptiles emerged, marking a pivotal moment in the evolutionary timeline. These were the Therapsids. Unlike their reptilian predecessors, Therapsids possessed a suite of traits that hinted at a closer relationship to mammals than to other reptiles. Their anatomy began to show signs of the mammalian characteristics that would later dominate the animal kingdom. Cynognathus, a prominent example from the early Triassic, exemplifies this transition. This creature, whose name means dog jaw, provides a fascinating glimpse into the evolutionary bridge between reptiles and mammals. Its fossil remains reveal features strikingly similar to those of mammals. The structure of its jaw and teeth, for instance, is remarkably advanced compared to other reptiles of its time. Unlike the sprawling posture of most reptiles, Synognathus likely held its limbs more erect beneath its body, allowing for greater agility and speed. This adaptation would have given it a significant advantage in hunting and evading predators. Its skull exhibited a larger brain case compared to earlier reptiles, suggesting increased cognitive capabilities. This larger brain case indicates that Synognathus may have had more complex behaviors and a higher level of intelligence than its reptilian contemporaries. Perhaps the most intriguing feature was the presence of differentiated teeth, including canines, incisors, and molars, indicating a more specialized diet. This dental differentiation is a hallmark of mammalian evolution, allowing for more efficient processing of a variety of foods. These mammal-like characteristics have led paleontologists to consider therapsids as the ancestors of mammals. The evolutionary lineage from therapsids to mammals is a complex and fascinating journey, marked by gradual changes over millions of years. Synognathus, with its blend of reptilian and mammalian features, represents a pivotal stage in this evolutionary lineage. It stands as a testament to the gradual and intricate process of evolution, showcasing the transition from cold-blooded reptiles to warm-blooded mammals. Its fossils unearthed in South America and Africa provide tangible evidence of the gradual transition from reptiles to mammals, a process spanning millions of years. These discoveries have been crucial in understanding the evolutionary history of mammals and the intricate web of life that has led to the diversity of species we see today. Paleontologists continue to study Synognathus and other therapsids to uncover more details about this critical period in evolutionary history. Each new discovery adds a piece to the puzzle, helping us understand how life on Earth has evolved and adapted over time. The legacy of Synognathus and its therapsid relatives lives on in the diverse array of mammals that inhabit our planet today. From the smallest shrew to the largest whale, the evolutionary journey that began with creatures like Synognathus has led to the incredible variety of life forms that we share our world with. Understanding the evolutionary bridge that Synognathus represents helps us appreciate the complexity and wonder of life's history. It reminds us that the story of evolution is one of continuous change, adaptation and survival, spanning millions of years and countless generations. While therapsids were evolving towards a mammalian lineage, a fascinating parallel evolutionary journey was unfolding. Another group of reptiles known as the archosaurs were charting their own evolutionary course, distinct yet equally significant. These ruling reptiles, the archosaurs, would eventually give rise to some of the most iconic creatures in Earth's history, including dinosaurs, crocodiles, and pterosaurs. 
Among these early archosaurs was Euparcaria, a small, agile reptile from the early Triassic period. This creature provides crucial clues to the early evolution of archosaurs. Fossil evidence suggests that Euparcaria possessed a distinctive feature that set it apart from many of its contemporaries, the ability to walk on two legs. While it likely moved on all fours most of the time, its hind limbs were notably longer and more powerful. This anatomical adaptation enabled it to adopt a bipedal stance, particularly when sprinting or pursuing prey. This ability to run on two legs would become a defining characteristic of the dinosaurs, setting the stage for their dominance in the Mesozoic era. Euparcaria's bipedal potential, coupled with its sharp teeth and grasping hands, made it a formidable predator in its environment. Its agility and hunting prowess were key to its survival. The fossils of Euparcaria, discovered in South Africa, offer a fascinating glimpse into the early evolution of archosaurs. These fossils are invaluable in understanding the origins of the dinosaur lineage. This small but significant reptile highlights the evolutionary innovations that paved the way for the dominance of dinosaurs in the Mesozoic era. Its adaptations were not just about survival but also about thriving in a competitive prehistoric world. By examining the skeletal structure of Euparcaria, scientists can draw comparisons with early dinosaurs, shedding light on the evolutionary transitions that occurred over millions of years. Digital reconstructions and animations bring Euparcaria to life, showing how it interacted with other prehistoric creatures. These visualizations help us understand its agility and hunting techniques, painting a vivid picture of its daily life. The sharp teeth and grasping hands of Euparcaria were not just for show, these features were crucial for catching and holding on to prey, making it an efficient hunter. The Triassic landscape was a dynamic and diverse ecosystem where various prehistoric creatures coexisted. Euparcaria was one of many species that thrived in this environment, each contributing to the complex web of life. Understanding the evolution of archosaurs, including Euparcaria, helps us piece together the broader timeline of life on Earth. Each species, with its unique adaptations, played a role in the grand story of evolution. Euparcaria, with its bipedal stance and predatory features, stands as a testament to the innovative adaptations that shaped the course of reptilian evolution. Its legacy is etched in the fossil record, offering insights into the dawn of the dinosaurs. No exploration of ancient reptiles would be complete without acknowledging the awe-inspiring Tyrannosaurus rex. This magnificent creature, often referred to as the Tyrant Lizard King, has become a symbol of prehistoric power and dominance. This colossal predator reigning supreme during the late Cretaceous has captivated imaginations for generations. Its sheer size and predatory prowess have made it a subject of endless fascination and study. Its massive skull, powerful jaws and bone-crushing bite force have cemented its status as one of the most formidable carnivores ever to walk the earth. The structure of its skull allowed it to deliver devastating bites capable of shattering the bones of its prey. Tyrannosaurus rex possessed a keen sense of smell, evidenced by the large olfactory bulbs in its brain. This heightened sense of smell would have been crucial for tracking prey over long distances, allowing it to detect the scent of potential meals from miles away. Its binocular vision with eyes facing forward allowed for depth perception, crucial for hunting prey. This adaptation gave it the ability to accurately judge distances, making it an efficient and deadly hunter. The most terrifying aspect of this apex predator was its bite. With teeth that could grow up to 12 inches long, it could deliver a bite force that is estimated to be over 12,000 pounds. Estimates suggest a bite force of over 12,000 pounds, capable of crushing bones and delivering fatal blows to its victims. This immense power made it one of the most feared predators of its time. Fossils of Tyrannosaurus rex, unearthed in North America, reveal a creature perfectly adapted for hunting large dinosaurs. These fossils provide invaluable insights into the anatomy and lifestyle of this incredible predator. Its powerful legs, short arms with two-fingered hands, and massive tail provided balance and agility. Despite its size, it was capable of moving swiftly, making it a formidable hunter. The Tyrant Lizard King reigned for millions of years, leaving behind a legacy etched in stone and an enduring fascination in the annals of paleontology. Its footprints, fossils, and reconstructions continue to captivate scientists and enthusiasts alike, reminding us of a time when giants roamed the earth. The story of the Tyrannosaurus rex is not just one of raw power and dominance but also of survival and adaptation. 
Its reign during the late Cretaceous period is a testament to its evolutionary success, and its legacy continues to inspire awe and wonder in the modern world. From scientific research to popular culture, the Tyrannosaurus Rex remains an enduring icon. Its presence in movies, books, and museums ensures that its legacy will continue to be celebrated for generations to come. As we continue to uncover more about this incredible creature, the legend of the Tyrannosaurus Rex grows ever larger. It stands as a symbol of the majesty and mystery of the prehistoric world, a true king of the dinosaurs.